While we tirelessly advocate the clutch pedal and stick shift way of life, we acknowledge that a well-tuned automatic occasionally can be the wiser choice. Perhaps stop and go traffic plagues your daily routine and your left leg needs a break. Or your significant other's attention is tapped out by steering and smartphone tasks. If so, you're a prime candidate for the BMW M2 DCT tested here, which delivers most of the joy of its stick shift sibling with a few unexpected pleasures. Computer is quicker speed, for example. As is often the case with modern cars, the self-shifting M2 is quicker than its manual shift sibling. An M2 equipped with the dual-clutch automatic transmission leads the way to 60 miles per hour and through the quarter mile by a significant 0.2 second. When you're running in Corvette territory, 4.0 seconds to 60 miles per hour, 12.5 at 113 miles per hour in a quarter mile, to tenths is significant. The autotostic gap is more than a car length at 60 miles per hour stretching to more than two car lengths by the end of the quarter mile. The auto box wins against the clock because of a few inherent advantages. A computer is better than a human at managing launch traction, and a dual clutch unit upshifts without interrupting power delivery. Also, it has shorter second, third, and fourth gear ratios. During our 30 to 50 mph and 50 to 70 mph passing tests, the gap is significantly larger and not directly comparable because the automatic nimbly grabs a shorter ratio while our procedure dictates to leave the stick in top gear. The second benefit is potentially better fuel economy, rooted in the fact that the DCT has 7 forward ratios versus 6 in the M2's manual gearbox. The automatic has a 47% wider overall ratio spread attributable to its 0.67 to 1 seventh gear, which yields an additional 2 miles per gallon, or 10%, in the EPA combined mileage rating. Given the 19 miles per gallon we logged during 1000 miles of mainly local driving, that 2 miles per gallon, again, is nothing to sneeze at. It's worth noting, however, that we averaged 20 miles per gallon in the manual equipped M2 we tested in California in February. Money matters BMW's dual clutch automatic does cost an extra $2,900 in the M2, which starts at $52,695 in base form. With or without the automatic, an M2 is a complete driver's package with a zesty 365-horsepower 3.0-litre turbocharged and six, a suspension tuned to please the most demanding wannabe racer, and some of the best brakes money can buy, a posied piston calipers gripping huge vented and cross-drilled rotors. The only other embellishments on our test car were $550 for Long Beach Blue Metallic Paint and a $1,250 executive package containing a heated steering wheel, a rear view camera, park distance control alarms to tell you that you're about to smack something at the rear, and active driving assistant cameras to help you stay in your lane and avoid colliding with a pedestrian or the car ahead. With Redan Bloom department stitching and corsive carbon fiber trim decorating the door pulls, dash, and console, this is one beautifully attired Bavarian. There's even a measure of practicality, as the M2's rear seat is surprisingly comfortable for a coupe, and the backrests split and fold to stretch the 14 cubic foot trunk's cargo capacity. What the automatic brings to the party is versatility. Press the shift lever to the right and you're in full automatic mode with a mix of reasonably gentle shifts during light throttle and more assertive gear changes at the 7000 revolutions per minute red line. Kick the accelerator to pass and there's a ferrule whoop as the engine swings the tack needle to between 5000 revolutions per minute and the rev limit with a rowdy snarl through the pipes accompanying each up shift. Pressing the shift to fore or aft puts the driver in command of gear selection. This requires rapt attention because upshifts are inhibited until a lever is yanked and nothing feels dumber than bouncing off the rev limiter. The third choice is to simply forget the shifter after the DS position is selected. Timely taps of the steering wheel mounted paddles signal the transmission when you need a higher or lower gear. Thanks to the miracle of modern electronics, 
There's a perfect front or load speed match and gear changes click off in fractions of a second. With 0.99 grams worth of grip available, quick and responsive steering, and front buckets that comfortably restrain the occupants, the BMW M2 is a 200 proof driving elixir. The engine, chassis, body, and controls are all tuned to blast you down a back road or through a challenging track section with utmost poise and purpose. While stick shifts are great for polishing your heel and toe technique during 8th driving, the automatic makes better sense when your hands are full of wheel and you need at least one braced leg to lock your carcass in place. For most drivers, perfecting but two pedals with a footwork and gripping the wheel with both hands yields the fastest, safest path into a corner, across the apex, and out the exit. That said, now that you're an expert on the reasons why this automatic can make sense, we promise to still respect you if you opt for the stick.